everyone, welcome to or back to my channel. I'm Julia and I am so glad that you're here. Today we're gonna be doing a room tour and I'm so excited. I actually just moved back from college and I redecorated my room with all the things that were in my dorm. So I'm super excited to show you guys. I've never actually done a room tour. I did a dorm tour, you can go check that out. I live with my parents at our house. I live in the basement. I have my own room to myself and a bathroom. I'll show you that too. And yeah, we're gonna keep this intro super short and we're just gonna jump right into it. And is it focused? How do I focus it? You don't, you just have to wait. Is it not focused? Just, there you go. Okay. All right. So we head in, and immediately we have this beautiful coffee station. I just set this up. I've never had this in here before. I have a Nespresso machine that can make like lattes with the espresso, and then I also have a Keurig. Oh, I just turned it on. I don't know. Turn it off. No. <laughs> A carrot just makes me normal black coffee, so I have both for the best of both worlds. <laughs> and I have this little thing of sugar and then some cute little jars to I'm gonna put like my spoons in. And then some plants. And down here I have all my mugs. And then this thing just has random stuff in it like eyeshadow and stuff. I don't know why it's there. <laughs> but then down here I have my milk frother that goes with that. And then also all of my K cups and all that good stuff. So have anything on this little cart yet. I have this like vase and then some candles down here, but I'm hoping that I could put like more coffee stuff or just anything that I need there. That's it for this little area. I also just made this little collage. I'm super excited about it and proud of it. Um, hey guys, so this is me editing and I just wanted to point out that the letter board is spelled wrong. Subscribe is spelled wrong and it's super embarrassing and I just wanted to point that out. <laughs> This is also most likely going to be where I'm going to be filming all my videos, so that's exciting. Now we come over here, and here is my closet. So I have my little laundry basket right there. But then over here, I have all my shoes hung up on this thing. Then I also have way more shoes down here, and then all my clothes. So these are all my shirts, and then my swimsuits are down here. Then I keep my pajamas up there, my pants, and then socks and underwear. Then over here is just random like crew necks and sweatshirts. Then I have this cute little board that I put up here that I can like put a to-do list on every day. Right here I have my belts and some necklaces hanging. And then today I also just hung up this little thing to hold my necklaces. And then I keep lots of my jewelry on this thing and that. And then in here, then over here we have just perfumes and just random stuff that I keep over here. This is like a little ticket box that I can put tickets in and then look at those later. And yeah, that pretty much wraps up my whole closet. Okay, then this little area is like my mirror that I always like take selfies in and look at when I am getting ready or picking out an outfit. I just put lights around it, super exciting about that. <laughs> um, over here is my desk area. These are all decorations that were in my dorm. I used to have picture frames up there, but I took all those down and hung these up on the same nails that all those picture frames went on. So I was surprised that it actually kind of looks nice. <laughs> um, then down here we have my desk. It's just kind of like a little space for me to do homework and edit at and all that good stuff. My face is in this. <laughs> Okay, then over here I had an extra mirror from my dorm. <laughs> Hi, Sarah. Um, and I didn't know what to do with it, so I just set it over here. There's a bunch of cords back here, so it's hiding all those cords. And I have this little thingy. Um, it just kind of has lots of more junk. It was in my dorm, so I put more of my stuff from my dorm in there. And since I'm in the basement, I have to keep the Wi-Fi and our pet thing down here, so those are sitting on top of that. Here I have a calendar. This is from last March, so March of 2019. <laughs> I still haven't changed it. I need to go change that. So that's embarrassing. <laughs> then I have these beautiful windows and some curtains. I usually keep the curtains closed at night because I don't like that, but during the day I love the sunlight. Here is my bed. I have a bunk bed, if you can't tell. I've had this bunk bed for a while. It's just super nice for like when friends come to stay the night, they stay up there. Super nice and easy so no one has to stay on the floor. I have a nice little nightstand over here that I keep my Apple Watch charger and then my phone at, at night. 
has this cute little Eiffel Tower from when my sister went to France and then a little plant. Here's all my pretty pillows. This bedspread and blankets and stuff are all from my dorm as well, so I stole all that and put that there. I also like didn't like the look of the underside of the bunk bed, so I took an extra sheet and like tied it up in the corners of it so that it was kind of like hidden. Hey guys, this is your mid-video reminder to go take an extra two seconds out of your day to hit that subscribe button and then another extra one second to hit the like button and then if you're feeling up to it, take an extra 10 seconds to search me on Instagram and follow me. Okay, thanks, bye! So under my bed, I do keep some boxes. These things are pretty cool. So this has my pants and then just more random stuff that I had from college. Then this one just has more random junk. You kind of get the idea. I like to hang my coats right here so I can just slip them on and leave. And then this little area is interesting. I have this, which literally is just full of stuff that I'm taking back to college with me in the fall. So it's just kind of sitting there holding my stuff for my gecko, which brings me to him. This is my gecko. I've had him for a couple years now. His name is Stefano. We love Stefano. He's recently been in care of my sister, Sarah, because I went to college, so she had to take care of him. So he just moved back down here today. Here I have this little grid thing. I have some little clips on it so that I can just hang up random little notes or pictures that I find on there. And then these drawers also just have some random things that are just some extra storage. But yeah, that's basically it for my room. Now we are going to go to my bathroom. As I mentioned, this is my bathroom. I don't share it with anyone. It is just mine, so I get to keep all of my stuff in it. Here's my cute little shower curtain that is years old. I have this metal stand that basically holds everything that I need. I have all my hair products and face washes, glasses, toothbrush, um, and here's like more hair ties and bobby pins. My makeup bag, makeup wash and mirror, extra toilet paper, and then all of my like curlers and straighteners and everything. Here's my little sink. Um, it needs washed, but I keep mostly the things that I use daily on the sink. Here's the mirror. Say hi, Sarah. <laughs> hey. um, I have a picture of Keegan right here. Oh, oh, oh. It's been there for a while. And then right here, this thing holds some hair things when they're hot, so that's really nice. That's it for my bathroom. I will say that there are a couple bad things about living in the basement. I constantly have spiders in my room, in my bathroom, in my shower. There are always spiders down here and it's creepy. We also just found that a mouse was living here while I was at college, so that was super nice. While I was moving back in and cleaning everything, I was finding mouse poop and popcorn bits everywhere, so that was lovely. <laughs> um, and then another thing is that since my room is like on the ground level, one time I had someone come and TP my house and in the middle of the night they came and knocked on my window and it scared the crap out of me. I was awake and on FaceTime with my boyfriend and I was like, oh my gosh, my family's about to get murdered. So it was super scary. And my sisters obviously don't have that problem because they live on the third floor of the house. So that's another thing that is unique about living in the basement. I'm like so proud of that. I printed those all out on my own and cut them and like put them up there together. It's not a collage kit. I did it on my own. If you need any tips, just go on Pinterest and print out pictures and then print them and then put them up. It was super easy and it only took me about 10 minutes, so. <laughs> I am just now noticing that this is spelled wrong. I am so embarrassed. There should be a C. Okay, oh my gosh, I just found the C and fixed it. That is so embarrassing. I filmed this whole video with it spelled wrong. <laughs> Oh well. And I am absolutely loving all of my new decorations. They're so cute. If you have any questions about where I got anything, I will try my best to remember. But yeah, that about wraps up this video. If you have any questions for me, leave them in the comments below and I will try my best to answer them. And if for some reason you want to see a full house tour of my house, comment that as well. And I'm sure I can make that video for you while we are here stuck in the house for two weeks. So. Yay, Indiana. But yeah, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you here again on my channel sometime soon.